This is Bernie Keesler, Cook and Star Ranch. We had some conversations on some Herefords that I have for sale and a, and a black uh, Angus little Brahma cross. So here we go. Four of the Herefords are right here. There's the little calf. Calf belongs to this cow right here. Come here, girl. You come here. You come in and see, you can just about walk right up to her. There's the calf. This one right here is the one that I, they say she's bred, she looks bred. I, I, I won't guarantee she's bred, but I will certainly, she certainly looks bred. Um, now, she, if you turn around, you can see she's had calves before because her mammary system is showing a little bit of age on it. But I think that cow's going to be about, oh, seven years old, maybe. Um, that's kind of what I'm guessing by looking at her, by looking at her teeth and all. That's kind of, that's my best guess. This girl right here is a completely different body style. Um, she's a, she's a little, little taller, not quite as wide as the others. She's not going to be, she's not going to be bred. She, I, I got her. Matter of fact, I traded a zebu for her, for a friend, friend of mine. He needed a zebu and he had this cow that he didn't need. So we just made a, not a zebu, a dexter. So anyway, he needed the dexter. I wanted the herper. So anyway. We made this straight up swap, and I know that she was open when I got her. Um, she, like I say, she's been running with the bull for about 30 days or so, but I wouldn't, again, I wouldn't guarantee that she's bred. But again, if you wanted to leave these guys here to get them covered to a low line bull, um, I don't really have a problem with that either. I'm going to show this, this little calf, and she's just as cute as she, she can be. There she is. All right, now the Brahma Cross. We'll pan over here and walk up to her. Again, uh, she's a good cow. Um, probably, if she's got any drawbacks on her, she's probably too friendly. Uh, she'll get all up in your business. Um, I'm surprised she's not o over here now. But she's a, uh, she's just a little bigger than what I want. Um, again, I can. I mean, I can breed her down. To a smaller bull then i know the the bull's gonna be a little bit smaller because he's a purebred uh low line so he's gonna be a little a little bit smaller um you know i would guess that she's bred uh it, she's gonna be bred to a longhorn bull if she's bred to anything at this point in time i had a had a little miniature longhorn bull out here for a little while till i got rid of all my little miniature longhorns i wouldn't wish that on my worst enemy but Anyway, here is here she is. Again, if you bought her in the group, um, I would sell her for eighteen hundred, which is about the price of the Herefords in the group. Um, if you just wanted her, then she's probably going to be in that twenty two, twenty one, twenty two hundred range. But I would sell her if you buy the group uh, for eighteen hundred dollars. So, so that'd be ten thousand eight for the entire group. But I think they're a group of good, good, good cows, I and mean, you can kind of see what I have out here now. Um, you know, to give you perspective, that right there is a is a two year old purebred low, low line. Uh, this one over here, I'm gonna walk this way, is another purebred low line. This one right here, this one right here is a low line. Uh, is a low line cross. You can see that this girl right right here is a little bigger than I than I than I want. Um, you know, she's just a little she's just a little bit bigger. That's more of what I'm looking for there, and that's what I kind of got in her. But I think she'll work in my pro program. And the other black cow back here, I mean, she'd work in my program too. Um, but anyway, that's kind of what I got. The the fifth the fifth uh, Herford. I have a picture of her. Um, she's gonna be, she's gonna, she's almost gonna look like a full sister of this one right 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 here. But she's gonna be two. Um, she's gonna be a two two year old. She's gonna have this shorter, wider body style. But she's up with the other group. So anyway, if you have any questions, give me a shout. Two one four seven nine six oh eight seven seven and kind of give you a perspective i'm gonna walk over over here because my neighbor's cows came up you can kind of see the difference in size 
A lot of people don't understand how small these guys are until they get up next to a full-size, standard-size cow. And then you can really tell the difference. Look at the size. Those are all breeding size animals right there. And look how much bigger. They're, well, three, four, five frame sizes smaller than these guys. Anyway, 214-796-0877. 214-796-0877. Thanks, bye.